Hello everyone, we will unbox and discover the H3 Plus Energy Circuit Breaker and its accessories. This connected circuit breaker includes measuring functionalities, and allows the remote display of these measurements. It can be associated to a Modbus communication module. The AXAL Energy Auxiliary, is an optional accessory, used for counting the make-break operations, as well as the number of tripping upon electromechanical faults. The panel display enables to view the measurements, and to adjust the settings of the energy trip unit. A set of cables is provided to connect all the components. Finally, the configuration tool is an expert accessory that is used to test and configure the circuit breaker. The LED technology, on the embedded display of the H3 Plus Energy Trip Unit, enables optimal readability. On the left side of the energy circuit breaker, you can find an overload prelam output contact, PTA. Inside the circuit breaker, you can transfer an alarm to an auxiliary circuit, using the OAC output contact. Next to it, you can see the ZSI Zone Selectivity Connector. On the left, there are two CIP connectors, to link the panel display to the Modbus communication module. And finally, the ACP connector, to link the AXAL energy auxiliary to the drip unit. The Modbus communication module is designed to connect the energy circuit breaker to a communication bus bar, which is compatible with Modbus RTU. There are two versions, with or without inputs or outputs. You can modify the Modbus parameters with the adjustment dials on the front. With this selector switch, you can activate or deactivate the 120 ohms end of line resistor. The CIP adapter must be connected from the top of the communication module, to one of the CIP connectors inside the energy circuit breaker. The communication module is supplied with an accessory for assembling on the circuit breaker. It can also be DIN rail mounted. On the top there are two 24 volts direct current input contacts, on the bottom, there are two 24 48 volts direct current output contacts. These two RJ45 terminals are used to connect a Modbus cable, and to retransfer the Modbus link to another communication module. Finally, the communication module must be connected to this 24 volts direct current terminal. The AXAL Energy Auxiliary has two versions, with or without AX and AL pre-wired contacts. The cables are used to connect these contacts outside the circuit breaker. The AXAL Energy Auxiliary must be correctly fixed inside the circuit breaker. It should also be connected to the ACP connector. Finally, you can find the accessory CIP adapter to connect the panel display 